Hey guys, it's Beatrix, and here we are back again with, um, with Baby Pixels Part 4. So here we are, where we were at last time. So I'm gonna go, I think I'm actually pretty close to beating this level, so hopefully maybe I can beat it by the end of this video. That would be super cool. So yeah, so here we are with these spikes. Oh, come on. Come on, you did it just fine like, just a minute ago. There we go. That wasn't a challenge at all. I'm just gonna jump up. And BOOM! Haha! <laughs> Chain reaction. Excellent. Okay, so now we don't have to worry about those guys anymore. So, yeah, you just, you just get near those guys and they just automatically explode. It's like, ah! So, yeah, so that's quite convenient to know that, that they can just explode on their own without really, without doing any sort of damage to them. No, come on, get down, get down from there. I won't let you fall off. Okay, good. So here we go. Boom. And boom. Okay. The first time I saw those spikes, I thought they were, you know, quite devilish looking, but, but if you like, you know, speed run them, kind of like how I did, it's they're really not bad at all. So yeah, so I'm glad that we learned that last episode. Okay, and then this is the part that got me. Just going through these stinking little... This little narrow... Thing. There you go! Ooh! Did you guys see that? That was impressive. Okay. So what you do here... Oh, you don't want to jump on top of those because they kill you, so... But you can go through them, I believe. With these. Okay, we'll make a checkpoint here, and I'll go ahead and, um... Jump up and oh, ooh! Well, we're glad that we did a, a save point there, right, guys? No, come on! Bam! Okay, now let's get the little tomatoes. Boom! Okay, now let's. Oh gosh, darn it! That was a close one. We Okay. Oh! That's gonna leave a mark. Oh my gosh, goodness! How do I keep doing that? It's like, I did harder things previously and I keep messing up on that. I don't even get it. Oh, come on. Come on, just- I just want a hug. I just want a hug. I just want to be your friend. Boom. Oh, get out of the way, Lolita! Okay, good. Man, that, I didn't want to repeat that again. Boom. And I'll just kick that guy off there, too. Okay, there we are. And, um, hmm. I don't think I'm gonna go for those tomatoes, because I don't think I need them. So, there you go. That point. Okay, excellent. So, let's go up here. Okay, oh, this is going to be especially difficult, I could just imagine that. Alright, let's... Whoa! I don't even fucking know how I did that on the first try. Man! Okay, gotta watch out for those buzz saws. Okay. Alright, nailed it! Yes! But bam finally beat the stage and I only died 30 times that's not too bad I know it seems like a lot more than that but no, it was 30 times I also remember I deleted the first file without meaning to so that must have been that must have been why it wasn't as high as you guys probably would have expected so yeah let's um continue on oh 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 watch out Alita oh okay so we're having another cutscene I, I, what I really like about this game, um, I heard that it's supposed to be kind of in inspired by those like kind of old school Atari games, but as well have have like some sort of a new new twist. And what actually attracted me to this game was that it was it's inspired by H.P. Lovecraft. Like it's kind of based on his spooky tales and such. So I thought that was really cool. I'm gonna bury you, and I will never love you in again. You ruined my skin, and you made my hands look like pincers. Oh, it came back again, though. Um. I'm not sure. Yeah. 
Why the hell not? I'll just go ahead and start it out. Start out the new level here. All right, the second dream, chapter one. Stand upright on your legs a while. Stand upright while you can. For soon as we lie where he is laid, and he is underground. William Butler Yeats. Very nice, William. I'll 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 be sure to remember that. I wonder if we'll face more um more villains. That's what I'm curious. Hopefully it's not just those zombies and little bummer guys. Oh gosh. Okay, here we go. Hey, what's this? Can I kill this? Ooh, apparently no, I can't. Okay. Oh, he got me. Wish I would've- Oh, dear. Ooh. That was close. Okay. <gasps> oh, that little asshole. He got me. I- Okay, I guess that answered my question if, about if there's gonna be any new villains. But that sucks that I can't kill that guy. Oh, and he's gonna keep- Oh my gosh! Seriously, man? Okay. Let's do this again. That's gonna be a pain in the butt to remember that I can't kill that guy. Okay. Hello! Oh gosh. That was close. Okay, um... Is there any way to make him, like, think I'm gonna jump? Ooh! I did it! Okay. So let's try to jump without dying in the process. I'm gonna throw you at that buzzsaw there. Ah, oh, I missed. I kicked way too high. It kind of reminds me of this kid I saw today at school. These two ki these two guys that were just playing soccer. Cause it's super nice outside. They were just playing soccer, you know, just kicking the ball around, and one of them just decides to kick them super high up in the air, all the way up into the um the residence building, all the way to the ceiling. And I like, I was actually from a distance when this happened. I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> like, I just couldn't help but to laugh at it. I thought that was, it was really funny. Oh, oh my gosh. And he just really do that. That little asshole. Like, did you guys see that he literally pushed me into the buzzsaw? Oh, and then like, I fell into the needles. Oh my gosh. That guy, I'm... I tell you, I don't know how I'm gonna get past that guy. Okay. Gotta be careful. Okay. And boom. Okay. Excellent. Oh. Okay, don't get me bust off. Okay. Oh, why, why did I do that for? Okay, we're just gonna... Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and end the episode right here, but I will be right back at season, um, I mean at season, on episode 5. I'll see you guys later. Bye!